Bro, what are you talking about, man? <sighs> that is some good iced coffee from Tim Hortons because I'm Canadian and every once in a while we need a reminder of that. Folks, it is just an excellent time to be alive. It is summer, drinking my iced coffee like two or three times a day. I need it to survive now and I don't even care, bro. Nobody cares. There's so much good stuff going on. You know, if you love 2K, I'm sure you're enjoying all these ridiculously overpowered cards they're dropping. There's nothing to complain about. And you know what? Today, I don't know. Some of you might be upset about this, but for me, I view it as a good thing. All right. As you can see from the title, this is our very last episode of Spin to Win for the entire cycle of 2K22. I know, right? Um, maybe, maybe some of you don't actually care, but this is episode 55. I think last year on 2K21, I went like 60 episodes. Episodes, but we're so deep into the summer, I figured, you know what? Doing a whole nother season just probably isn't going to cut it. And today we find ourselves in the NBA finals. And like I said, what a time to be alive. I'm about to win the NBA finals, go out on a high note. No nothing bad could happen, right? You have no idea. And surely after that intro of me rumbling, uh, rambling uh, on about how great I am, I'm probably going to take an L today. But as you can see, I am in the NBA finals coming off a uh, 60 point victory, 70 point victory. I've been dominating. So this would be a shock if I get a crazy opponent, I'll tell you that. All season, just looking at this one last time, we have been working on our Jordan rules board. It's been a really fun addition to the series. Let me know if you guys like it. Um, It doesn't really matter, but maybe it'll make a return for 2K23. Who knows? And the team that we are almost finishing our spin to win series with looks like this. The reason I say almost is because we do have some upgrades coming. But as we know, Michael Jordan, Scottie Pippen, Horace Grant, three bulls as the center of our team, the focus, the actual center of our team, Wilt Chamberlain. He's been great the last couple videos since I added him. But yeah, we went to zero from zero to 100 with this lineup, like two videos in a row. I've just stacked this lineup completely. And today it's going to get just ridiculously better because I get to upgrade two cards by one tier which like, I mean, I have a really stacked team already. Plus I did get the option from a W wheel to pack a punch one card. I think I know where we're going with it, but let's check the comments. Diego Martinez says, Jay, for your upgrades, definitely get invincible slash power within Luca. I would upgrade Kazi to KD or T-Mac. Lastly, Opal Drummond to Yao or Taco. Oh my word, just reading all those names. It's like, yeah, this is a, this, this was gonna get serious and it will get serious. You're an idiot. Jay's happy helper says, invincible Luca, of course, tis the season KD for Kazi, any Yao Ming or Taco you can buy for Drummond. Uh, did Jay's Happy Helper copy paste that comp? They were basically the exact same comment. Kyle Banner says replace Kazi with D Rose. Interesting move. Shump give Luca, yeah, uh, replace Tari with Kevin Durant. Interesting. So another shout out for Luca and KD. Master Matt, my boy, says, okay, you have to get Luca. Make this the best lineup ever. As for the rest, turn Kazi into a good Kobe Taco to replace Andre Drummond because why not? Bro, the comments, as you can see, almost unanimously suggesting the same player. So I did go through, read the comments. Let me just shout out everybody who comments or who has commented on this series. I know a lot of you have probably been watching since like last November when I started the series. It really does mean a lot to me, man. I appreciate all the support, but uh, why am I getting sentimental? Okay, we, we know, let's just ignore it. And obviously as the comments suggested, this was pretty easy, most of the upgrades. So pack a punch, uh, pack a punching one card. I mean, we have Luca right here. What, what a blessing, right? And to give my opponent that I will play just a bit of a fighter's chance, uh, chance. I didn't get Invincible Luca. I actually didn't quite have enough MT, but it doesn't matter. We know Luca cards are broken this year. And this version that I picked up actually does have 49 Hall of Fame badges, which is way more than this stock card comes with. Like it, With Luca, it doesn't matter. It's just I've got his jumper now, and that's that. As for our upgrading two cards, one tier, um, I think it was unanimous that we boost Kazi up to a Dark Matter. A lot of you were saying, you know, oh, a basic version of Dark Matter Kevin Durant, tis the season or whatever. But uh, the reason I don't have have a lot of MT is because. Oh, that's right. I just recorded a all-time Warriors team builder. I have Endgame Kevin Durant in my collection. And guess what? In case you didn't know, this card is freaking unbelievable. His jaw, his he got like set shot for it, just flicks the thing up. I'm very excited about this. Yes, I have an amazing KD and he will be in our lineup. And last but certainly not least, Andre Drummond. It was real for one game, but we are indeed welcoming in Taco Ball, the most basic version of Dark Matter Taco. I didn't think I needed any better because uh yeah 
This boy can shoot threes with an 83 rating, 35 Hall of Fames. I honestly just didn't want to wait for any auctions to expire, so I had this one in my collection. What more do you want, bruh? Even with a basic version of Luca Taco, this this lineup, like I don't even know what to say. I'm gonna put, uh, you know what? No, I'll keep Luca off the bench. I'm definitely gonna put uh, KD in the starting lineup. Sorry, Scotty, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotta do what's best for the team. Th uh, yeah, it looks pretty good. Yep, probably the best lineup I've ever created in Spin to Win. The greatest way to finale uh, to have a finale in this series would be with a W in the NBA Finals, and this team is uh, definitely gonna make it happen for me. Right? 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 Rongo. Oh. oh. Okay, okay. I've seen better versions of T-Mac. Um, he's beat clutch time though. Uh, this is gonna be tough. Yeah, very tough. It makes sense though, Brad. I've been asking for comp this whole season and I literally just have not gotten it. So yeah, go figure in the NBA finals. This is when we're gonna see some, a little something, something wilt to the rim. Getting blocked. Yep, saw that coming. KD, oh my word. Yeah, in case you guys haven't seen Endgame Kevin Durant, his jumper is quicker than you could even imagine. Like, even before you think about it, it's like, oh yeah, he's shooting that thing. He is shoot. Oh, that's way off. Big boards, Will. Big boards. Oh, Horace with the big boards. I will take it. Let's go. Let's go defense to offense. That is the plan. And Horace is wide open. Mid-range? Um, okay, that was a weird catch, but I'll take it. Now let's come up here. We're, we, we trap you, D-Wade. No, that's off. That what? Okay. My man's is really trying to shoot with D-Wade, and I'm trying. What was that? Okay. I see that my opponent is now pressing, which is not fun. Perfect. But Wilty boy, he is on one. Looks like all I really have to focus on is corralling this pick and roll with D-Wade. He got away from me there, but he missed the shot. Let's go. If your offense doesn't mix up, my guy, you are in for a long night. Oh yeah, KD. Oh, I didn't green it, but it don't matter. That's endgame K-Dizzle coming to save the day in this series. Let's go. Bro, my guy is trying to shoot everything right now with D-Wade. I, I mean, I guess that probably works for most of the time, but not um, not against me. I mean, he's shooting a lot of bad releases, though. If he starts clicking on those, I could be in trouble, but I like this eight-point lead I've got right now. Yeah, yeah, we keep D-Wade off the line. I'm content to let up twos at this point in the game. Okay, I'm probably getting a little bit too high on my own supply here. This is definitely going to be a game like my opponent i can tell he knows what he's doing at least to a certain extent uh he's abusing me inside because he's got mismatches so yeah as much as i do feel confident i think i'm gonna win this game i mean i'm hoping so obviously uh, i just i can't get too carried away and reckless however i do have my boy luca back yo i haven't used luca in a minute look at this awful look, he's not even trying to do anything other than <laughs> he's not trying to bait passes he's just trying to sit in off ball. i gotta take advantage i'm definitely gonna have to change up my pick and roll coverage because right now he's getting stuff at will but i have missed like two shots this entire game if that keeps up it don't matter wait a minute wait is there a point guard version of yao or is why is luka guarding yao ming hold on there must be a point guard version right like there's a point guard version freaking every player at this point in the game thanks to 2k let's go luka oh yeah kick out to yao uh not to yao to talk oh there i finally missed a shot okay hate to see it Come on, I gotta start playing aggressively on these pick and rolls. Yes, sir. I was looking for the steal from behind as per usual, but Taco slipped right in there, bailed me out. Uh, Taco, yes, sir. Nope. Oh my, really? Real? Okay, all right, all right, all right. Yep. Oh, he missed one too. Yeah, that doesn't, I, that doesn't even make me feel better. Like that should not be happening to, okay, to either of us. Oh, that's crazy. That is crazy. And I'm sick of this man's off ball. Can we please, can we please figure it out, team? Thawn maker. Okay, yeah, yeah, sure. Just give him a contest. Whatever, man. What, whatever. Everything that can could go wrong is right now in this game. At least I'm still winning. All right, I'll say that. I should definitely not be winning this game the way things are happening right now, but I am. Another one. I keep missing shots. Taco finally dunks the ball. Was that really that hard? Ooh, defense to offense. Iman with the steal. KD with the triple. Oh, yeah, Wilt. Oh, yeah, Wilt. Get shifty on him. Yes, Shumpert. Yeah. Oh, this time it's Shumpert finishing the defense to offense. 10 point lead. Oh, my word. He ties it right back up, man. Well, this is what we wanted, bruh.
This is probably, well, I, I, I think this is what you all wanted. This is what I wanted. A competitive game to end the series. That's that's all there is to it. Tari Eason, rookie. Uh, I wish that was a three, but I'm going to have to sweat all the way to the end of this game. And even then, I might lose. It's a very real possibility I lose this game, which is super tough. And so he's got Yao in there again. Let me go this way with, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We causing some chaos. Horse, easy fade. Easy fade off the chaotic press. Six point lead. Now it's Horse Grant ahead of the break. Horace Grant, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, now we got MJ on Mark Eaton. Yes, sir. He's about to be Perfect. eaten, Mark. Yeah. Defensively, that sounded strange. Just let's ignore it. No threes, baby. No threes. Oh, I was back there with Wilt this time. Yo, if I get like one stop in this game, I'm going to feel like the game's over. So I just need to bide my time. Wait for the big one stop. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, well, too good. Too good. <laughs> there it is. There it is. Oh, he forced a bad shot. That I did not do anything defensively. That's it. That's it. Because this is a KD. This is the dagger right here. KD, step back. Nope. Chill. Chill. I'm not going to waste that one stop though. Michael Jordan, it's your series goat. Eight point lead. Come on. I can taste it. Oh, they didn't give me the, steal, the charge. They didn't give me the charge. Uh, it's all good. Wow. We really leave Mark Eaton of all people hitting a big shot. Okay. It's all good. Horse going right to the corner for... Oh, he didn't jump. He didn't jump. Good defense by my opponent there. Okay. Can he defend KD even one time this game though? That is the question. I kind of think it's a no though. Oh yeah, Horse. Horace Grant. That's why we grinded for him. Eight points. We're just going back and forth now, but I got the cushion. I'm fine with it. One more stop and I think we've got this game and I know what he wants. I know he wants the fading three. I'm trying to click onto a montage. It's not working, bro. He knows how to... Wait a minute. What are you doing? Okay, that could be bad. That could be bad. That That is not on schedule. That is not what we... Oh, Iman, big D, big D, Iman. Four points, let's go. I just gotta be smart here and I win it. I just gotta be smart and I win this tough... Woo. Yo, this KD kind of handles like an 18-wheeler. It's not easy to handle this KD. Come on, KD. <laughs> Wilt! That was such an ugly bucket. I didn't even know what I was saying there. Okay. Yep, he finally missed it. He, he finally missed one. Yes. Oh, what a back and forth fourth quarter. My first tough matchup in this entire season. I don't know how I've been so blessed for like 10 straight games. We get a battle here, but you know what? We built this team perfectly, man. We built it perfectly, including our last minute additions. The spin to win wheel never ceases to bless, my friends. That is a victory. And that's another NBA Finals win in the books. Yeah. I think so. Bro, I'm so glad that happened. Uh, an easier matchup would have been nicer for like my own sanity, but for the content, of course we needed a battle. And as you can see, my opponent actually made more threes than me. He was just chucking in the fourth quarter, but in the fourth, I didn't miss a shot. Look at that offense. Wow. I'm actually impressed with myself. That's pretty good right there. As a team, I mean, y'all had to know. Y'all had to know upgrading Kazi Russell one tier to end game Kevin Durant 10 for 10 in the finals. Oh, wow. 25 points. I didn't even like try to do that specifically. Horace Grant was amazing. Carried us in the fourth quarter. Taco. Uh, nope. He was bad. It was MJ. It was really like four players that carried my whole team. I bet if we look at plus minus my bench. Yeah. Minus three, not too bad, but it was noticeable. They got beat when they were out there. Wow. As we end each and every spin to win video, a look at our board for the final time in 2K22. Your boy did just win the NBA finals once again and for those of you keeping track at home this was the third nba finals i won in five seasons of spin to win this year that is 60 percent above 50 that's pretty good i lost back to back in like the playoffs at one point that was stressful but the last two seasons we've really cruised man and big part of it was your guys's help great suggestions obviously a big number of these cards have only joined the team uh in the last couple episodes like kd like luca who i actually didn't do much with that video wilt he came uh, just a few episodes ago but overall this team was so fun to use over the season. Remember the first episode of this yeah. season with Michael Jordan? I think I scored like 50 some odd points with him. He became like a secondary weapon, a, a, an afterthought here down the stretch, but MJ's the goat for a reason, Brian. Invincible MJ. Very good card, I must say. And all together, man, it's really always awkward to like uh, end things, you know, um, spin to win is, is ending for the, for, for the series. For
for the season. I don't even know what I'm saying. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. As always, I believe this is year 18, 19, 20, 21, 20. I think this was my fifth year of Spin to Win since I created this series. Always a blast. Always love the comment interaction. So let me know down below if you guys want to see it when 2K23 drops in a few months. I, I bet you probably do. We'll have to see what I can do. But if you only watch these videos on my channel, I highly suggest you check out some other ones. They can be pretty good too. So yeah, what a great way to end, man. 55 episodes of Spin to Win in the books and another championship one. I guess that's how we go out. We go out on top, baby. <sighs> With my Tim Hortons. Amazing. Sponsor me, please. Stand by.